I know it's been a while, but I have my reasons. I have my reasons. But of course, can't start the video off where I get my first two shout outs. They're gonna be right here. So do me the favor, go to the channel, show them the love, and of course, just be an awesome community. Now, if you want to shout out, all you gotta do is like this video, subscribe to my channel, and of course, leave hashtag Seggy Time in the comments of the first two people. To leave that comment down below, we'll get a shout out for the following video. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell that way we are future videos that get posted and you never miss out on any shout outs. Little, little underexposed here. Let me get to where there's sun. Now there's too much sun. It's perfect, perfect right here. Now, I do have my reasons why I haven't actually filmed a vlog. I have been streaming a lot. If you guys do watch my YouTube channel, I've been streaming Fallout 3 pretty much every day or around every other day. And that game is just, that game's so addicting. Like, I want to go home and play more Fallout 3, but it is a weekend. I do want to ride. Also, I haven't been riding as much as I usually do as well. But that's just, that's just because I haven't been like feeling myself lately the way I should feel. You know, like happy. I'm feeling, feeling pretty down and it's mainly actually because of the YouTube channel. Now I'm overexposed. Now I'm perfect. Now I am going to go ride. I'm going to go ride right now. I'm heading down to Carolina, of course, to do the exact same things that I normally and usually do every time I do ride, which is not really true because at least I'm out there going and trying to do new things. But the reason why I haven't posted anything actually, a vlog wise, is just is just because well a lot of people brought me down people that i thought were my friends turned out to not be friends turned out to be just really really fake people and all it was was just so they can get some kind of glory you know trying to get their name known and it sucked that you know there's people out in the world that don't want to see you succeed and they rather pick at you because they're not living the life that they want to live. It's pretty much all it really is. But that that's one of the reasons, one of the reasons. Like, I understand YouTube, you know, you're gonna get picked on, you know, it's YouTube. People aren't always gonna like what you're doing, but you shouldn't be discouraging people, really. If you are friends and you guys are riding together, just doing something, you know, out and about, don't be discouraging people, don't be like, doesn't count for example you know be like you know hell yeah you know try to get it this way try to get it better do this way better than you usually do it all right pretty much what i'm trying to get as like if you're with a group of friends and you guys are out say riding for example and that person is going out there and trying to learn new tricks trying to just do new things don't be like oh my god you know that person's this that person's that and then Try to consider yourself a friend because you're really not a friend if you're discouraging someone from trying to learn new things that goes with everything in life like don't be a salty dude you know instead of trying to bring someone down go out there and learn something new yourself and i'm saying that because that's pretty much what's going on with me and it's evolving well it's around this youtube channel too like they're throwing it in the mix but really it's just people discouraging other people like it's it's dumb it's dumb and also well, now what's really bugging me is actually some particular person went and said to a bunch of the people that you know if you can't handle shit talking i'm saying that shit talking in bmx you shouldn't be riding think about it, you're in a group of people right and you're shit talking to each other all you're doing is putting down each other and eventually no one's gonna even progress no one's gonna learn new things because all you're gonna do is just talk trash about everything that y'all do it's dumb remember bmx is everything but right now bmx is all about just having fun and progressing 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 and also when you ride in a big group of good people that are stoked to see progression you will progress more just saying that for you little ones you want to get super good in bmx ride or anybody really just ride with people just ride with people have fun have fun I need to slow down real quick. Oh no, my shoes! But yeah, you know, that's why I haven't did a vlog in a month. I just, I've just felt down. If you guys don't already know, I do have depression and I do have PTSD. And like, I like vlogging. I really do like vlogging because it keeps me out of the house. It keeps me on my bike, keeps me fit. But well, I'm not vlogging 
I'm not out here trying to progress on a bike. It sucks, like, it sucks. Pretty much, if I had a gun, my good life, if I had a gun, I would've shot myself already. I know, it sucks saying that, but it's true. But yeah, enough, enough with that. I am gonna try to get more vlogs done, but I am streaming almost every day, about every day. Where'd it go? Go, go, go. You're good. <laughs> but yes, I am gonna try to get these vlogs going again. I did figure out how to do turn downs. I can't click them all the way, but I figured out how. And they are on my goal of my 2018 goal trick list with the 540s, which I can't do at Carolina for some odd reason. It's hard there. So I'm gonna do that right now. But I have been streaming a lot of Fallout 3 pretty much every day, around every other day actually. So if you guys wanna join the stream, the streams are actually fun. I wanna mention, remember, if you guys aren't from El Paso, and if you guys are from El Paso and you guys are part of the BMX community here in El Paso, Texas, I am throwing a BMX jam here in El Paso Sunday, August 19th at South Kleinfeld Skate Park from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. There's going to be a long jump, high jump, best trick, two games of foot down, prizes, food, all that stuff. It's my gift to you guys because, again, you guys did save my life back in September. I just want to show you guys I do love you. You know, gotta help support the scene because they do support me back. I also want to thank Empire BMX. I want you guys that are going to go to the jam to go to Empire BMX's Instagram. I'll have it right here. Go tell them thank you because they are the one actually sponsoring the Jammy Jam on August 8th, 19th. August 19th. It used to be August 18th, but it's August 19th. I changed it to a Sunday because, well, no one does anything on Sundays. That way, everybody does not have an excuse why they can't go to the Jammy Jam August 19th at 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. South Carolina Skateboard. And I'm almost at Carolina, so I'm gonna put you guys away for a bit and just get there. So I actually bent my pedals on Friday. I had the BSD restart pedals, which are truly one of the best pedals. But I bent the axle, it happens, my bike dropped. So right now I'm using the new Odyssey Path Pros. I'm actually gonna be giving those out too. Not these pedals, but I'm gonna be giving three sets of them out at the jam. I'm gonna say they're really, really big. Like they feel weird on my bike. It's too much. Like it's too much surface area for my feet. But of course you gotta get used to them. I'm gonna do a trick though. I'm gonna do this for Frankie. This is, well, I don't technically like ETs. I consider them not to be a real trick. It's sort of just like dragging your hand on the floor and calling it a trick. It's really not a trick. But Frankie does what they would call chainsaws, but in Frankie words, he calls them wee-wees. So I'm gonna do a wee-wee to manual to wee-wee in. This is for you, Frankie. Well, because you landed that back hook to cement, which was super cool. doing this right now no joke it's only 100 degrees but it's still too hot my eyes feel like they're on fire it's on fire but the park is empty so I might as well take a time and try to get the turn down cleaner today I did get it somewhat decent wasn't the best in photos it looks good when you take that snapshot when it's right there but the problem I was having with turn downs is not the actual motor whip you do have to like motor whip into it it's the part where you have to get your leg through the frame and I wasn't doing that I always kept like being stiff so my foot so my leg kept getting stuck with the seat but once I figured out how to get my leg through the frame it became, it became a lot easier now I just need to learn how to like pull it in more and then I can say I did the turn down correctly
sun is going down and just this heat the heat really did get to me i look super skinny but yeah the heat did get to me but it did feel good it did feel good to be back on the bike the pedals they're, they're a little too big for my liking like there is such a thing as too big but of course you got to get used to things shout out to my youtube channel hyper jumpy everything <laughs> i was saying i'm gonna call it a day I'm tired so of course i will be streaming pretty much all this week on youtube i'll be playing fallout 3 if you guys want to join me i might play fortnite might i don't know yet i'm not really that big of a fan of fortnite but if you guys want to join me in the game of fortnite i'm always willing to join a party but i suck so yeah i'll be playing fallout 3 this week on youtube streaming so hit up the streams but of course help me with my goal of 2018 of 10,000 subscribers so like this video subscribe and of course i'll see you guys next time i really do want to tell everybody that's always been there for me and it's always helped and supported this channel i love you guys thank you from the bottom of my heart peace you said it peace